We could all start a football team tomorrow and we could be in the FA Cup. That is the beauty of it. That's what is that's why you have to love it. People forget about non league football. And they forget about it at their peril because that is football. All right, you get five minutes good football, then bluff and bluster and ineptitude for the rest of the game. And you get these crap sides where the goalkeeper's got a beard. You know, he's got his shorts are too tight, and well, the strips don't match. One bloke's shirt is more washed than the other bloke's shirt, and they're playing. They're playing the big teams, you know, and it's. And it's hilarious, and it's suddenly you realise that that's, and they've got a chance. You know what I mean? That sort of big, baldy, bearded, fat ass centre forward, whose number nine on his back is too small, and it doesn't match the number eleven, who's his too big on his chair. Suddenly they're playing against the stars, playing against your favourite team. And you have a chance, you know, you have a chance against them and it definitely messes them up, messes up the big teams. The whole of the football season is under cloud, always. It's a pissing down with rain, it's snowy, it's a pitch that's brown. But on the cup final day, it's a perfect pitch and sunny. And you look at football in a totally different way that day. That's the thing, isn't it? The FA Cup ends in such grandiose style, doesn't it? It's massive. But it begins, it begins in a fucking field with a cow shit on it. It's the last sporting thing that England has to offer, really. <laughs>